Okay, for the Model Y back seat box storage compartment, you can see how nice it fits between the uh, upright bolsters or uh, the um, platforms for the Model Y seats. And of course, our back seat lighting upgrade kit is awesome. Can't see the lights at all way underneath. Uh, anyway, sorry about that. Um, let me show you how it installs and uninstalls. So it's installed now. Now it's uninstalled. So the carpet or the female side of the uh, carpet kit in the Model Y grabs right on to the Velcro we attach on the back of the box. So you just insert it like this and press back and that's it. Works great. So you can have it all the way in. You can have it a little bit to the side. When you open it, actually stays up or open, and then the Velcro closes it. All right, let's show you how to assemble this thing. It's a little tricky. When you first get the box, you might think, what is this? How is this going to go together? But we're gonna show you that next. And it's gonna arrive in this box. Okay, to get the box in this shape so it fits right in your car, we're gonna show you how to assemble it. So you're gonna receive this box from us. And I'll put this one here, and this one here. Okay, so when you get the box, you're gonna think, oh, it's so thin, how does it fit in here? Well, it's not that complicated, but it is very different. So again, like it says in the description, we're using real thick, hard cardboard, and these are the two end pieces. And you'll notice the Velcro piece is attached to the sides. This is gonna suspend it or help you assemble it like in this picture here where the velcro is invisible so anyway just put these aside right there and now this is the rest of the box so it's just a long configuration of velcro pieces that are going to go all the way around like this to be opened and closed so this is the box just lay it all down like this put the velcro around the top now you're going to understand how this works when we put the sides on. And these are the sides. Okay, so what's the first step? Now, the first step is locating where they're going to go. So obviously this triangular piece is going to go here. So I will start off with both of them side by side like this. And again, this is the right piece and this is the left. So, you want to take this piece here and press it right down over this edge. So, put it right nice and square on there. That's going to stick the Velcro to it so you don't see it on the sides. Then the next piece is going to be the bottom. So, when you look at it, just try to figure out this is going to be one, two, three on both sides. So there's one, here's two. In order to insert two, you have to just get it just like this, and insert number two. But I think it's best after assembling a couple of these to just line it up nice and straight and we'll do them at the same time. So again, the back side is going to go first, which is going to be this one. So what we're doing is we're going to double check it before we go to the trouble of doing it. Obviously, it's going to go like this. So we're doing it correctly. So we'll take the long piece on the flat side. So this is the right angle almost. And we're going to put it right down like this. Just like that. So now we have our two halves on, and now we'll flip the bottoms down. Just like this. And we're gonna close the box up a little bit, and as we do that, we're gonna push this piece down. So just like that, stick that piece down, and go to this side, press this piece down. 
and we'll do some fine tuning as well. But you see we got uh, two of the sides on. The third side is the front side. So we're gonna flip these pieces forward towards you. And then we're going to just lift this side up. And I like to get this really nice and close to it like this. Make sure you don't see any of the male Velcro. If you do, pull it off. Just don't want to see the Velcro when I look in the box. Um, same thing with this side. Fold the Velcro down from the sides. And line it up. Make sure you're all the way at the top. And slide the bottom down. And you can see that's the basic principle. The Velcro is holding the side pieces on. It's not waterproof or anything, but uh, that's it. Close this and you're good to insert it in the car. And remember these two male sides are gonna stick right to the back of the center console in the back seat where it's fully carpeted. Nice, easy, simple design. And again, if you have any gaps, just Pull it off, lay it down nice and flat like that, and then up the side here. But it looks great. It's nice and perfect, and the nice thing is this is the exact width between the seats. So like I said in the Model Y, when you open it, it actually stays up like this. So you can leave it up if you want to, or you can close it for privacy. But it's nice to put things in there, game controls, you know, Lysols, uh, RPM Tesla business cards, uh, or your own, your adapters, just things for your rear passengers uh, in the back seat, and then just close it up. We think it's great, nice, and very affordable. Um, and we've got hundreds of them in stock, already selling well um, during the memorial sale. But that's it, Velcro assembly. No screwing, no, nothing fancy, and it fits great. And it assembles pretty easy, right? Thanks again for watching, and uh, thank you again for your business. We appreciate all of our customers, and uh, we're looking forward to our ninth year in business next year. And uh, the products keep on coming, and we all love our Teslas. Man, can't imagine a world without them. But thank you, thank you, thank you. It's the Model Y backseat storage box in stock now. Some assembly required. Goes from this to this in about uh, two minutes. Thank you.